Welcome back to my channel, Just Lost JC here or whatever. Ah! Okay, so this video is gonna be pretty simple. We moisturizing my hair. This is how I moisturize my hair when it is in my protective styles. This is a bit updated because I know I have one from a while ago, but we showing the real tea now. So this is a spray bottle. This is all you're gonna, not all. What am I saying? It's not all. You're gonna need more. So pull out your wallet and start spending monies. You're gonna need a water bottle which is what I start off with. I think water is the foundation. So you just wanna do a little spritz. Of course I'm wearing a, one of my favorite turtlenecks, which is not a good idea, but whatever. It's gonna be fine, it's gonna be all right. It's gonna be okay. My hair at this point feels particularly dry. So I'm really going, I'm really going in. I'm really going in. This is some warmish, warm water. Warm water. You're gonna get the warm water in there because water is the foundation of hydration. You know what I mean? Anyway, so then I just run, run, run that through. Ooh, man, this feels good. <laughs> this actually feels epic. Let me make sure to get my ends because why not? Once I'm done with that, then I like to go in with a leave-in conditioner. This one, guys, is my, ooh, that's really bright, Giovanni's. Literally. <laughs> I love this stuff. I love this stuff. This one is almost finished. I need to order a new one, but <sighs> alas, I have not done that yet. So we're just going to be, you know, a little, a little trash, a little ratch, you know. Anyway, so I got some of the product on there smush it and just get it in get it in there really it's nothing to it but to do it <laughs> what am i saying i literally have a mirror right here so i'm just using that to help me but yes 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 that's my leave-in <sighs> man and I like to focus a lot of the things on the ends, of course, the scalp, not the scalp, the top of the hair, ooh, the top of the hair too should get some, but my main focus is usually the end to the middle of the hair, because that's the part that's not really getting the natural oils produced from my scalp. And it's in these twists, so it's not, the oil's not gonna go all the way down, as you guys know. Next, I like to go in with this cream. It's a, the Superfruit Multivitamin Frizz Taming Smoothie. And I have a lot of this stuff because I do not use it that often. I use it when I'm doing this and I don't do this that often. I find in twists my hair maintains the moisture that it has from when I wash it for a good amount of time. So that's always nice. But anyway, again, you go right in with this stuff and this stuff feels so good especially on top especially especially on top of the Giovanni stuff girl or guy it feels good this feels, feels around around smooth by around around smooth get you know get that nape too you know what I'm saying why not okay that gives a nice moisturized feeling and then last but definitely not least you want to take your castor oil this one has looked like it's been to hell and back like it went down 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 there and it was sent back on a ship that exploded and it barely survived with its life but we thank God because it's here now and it's giving us all the life and it's giving us all the blessings. Yeah, man. Yes, yeah, man. Anyway, Sha. So I just take some of that in there. It's nothing, nothing major or whatever in castor oil. It's thick. Thick humanoid. Thick heaven. Thick a mania. Thick journey is thick. But it's fine. Because it's probably better. So 
You could use a lighter oil. You can use any oil you want, honestly. Or obviously, but, you know, I'm just using what I have. Which I've been loving castor oil these days. So, just kind of pat that in there. And then I like to do a little, because it is castor oil, I like to massage my scalp and get the rest that are on my fingertips onto my scalp because, I mean, it's best for making the hair tick, 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 you know, so it's best when it reaches the scalp in terms of like helping with thickness. That's what it's supposed to do. Then, I do this weird thing, but I like to take a bit of water on my fingers and I like to touch my scalp with it. <laughs> I just want to get some water into onto my scalp. It's been, it's been a while since water touched it since the last time obviously I washed it so I like to do that and sometimes when I feel like my scalp might be dry I just go right in there right up to the the root and do a bit of that. It's nothing major but I don't know I like it's like some moisture on my scalp after it's been a while. And especially since I do work out. I feel like there has been liquid on my scalp but it's been like sweat and stuff like that so just to I don't know I think I don't think this is the right term but alkalize alkanala alkalize I don't know just to dilute that salty sweaty water on my scalp I just feel like this helps that somehow it's not scientifically proven I might be completely off base and misinformed but I like doing it and I just it, uh, I just always feel so refreshed and then I take my fingers and do a little press 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 motion as you can see with that in my scalp and it feels amazing, 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 amazing. And the thing about moisturizing my hair is it does create a lot of frizz on top, as you can see. Way more than was there before. So I don't just do this immediately after I twist my hair. Obviously, immediately after I twist my hair, my hair is way more moisturized because it's just been washed and the leave-in was just put in and all that good stuff. So it doesn't really need this process. But I like to do this process at least for the first time after I've twisted my hair. I like to wait a good amount of time until it feels like it really needs it because I know that it makes my twists look, you know, crazy and fluffy. So I just put my hair into a ponytail, but that is it guys. That's literally the way I moisturize my hair when I feel that it needs that moisture. And right now it feels good. My scalp is singing in the rain. Literally singing, singing songs of freedom. Sing his songs, her freedom right now. I'm just telling you. So that's it, you know, called it, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. Um, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on Instagram, cause I got an Instagram now or whatever. So I'm gonna be plugging it in every video because <laughs> that's what I see other people do. So I'm like, mm, why can't I? You feels me. Anyway, follow me on Instagram. I'm gonna put it right here on the screen. I'm gonna link it down below. I'm gonna be posting pictures of my hair, you know, so you can see. Because uh, I do different hairstyles. Well, not that often. This is this is me. This is who I am. Accept me. Love me for who I am. But sometimes I do switch it up. I get some, you know, this. I get some that. So I'm going to be putting at that on my Instagram. Also fashion. Because, you know, I like to throw a little look together. You know what I'm saying? A little one, two. And you'll be able to see way more of that on my Instagram than I know that I show you guys on this YouTube channel. Because I ain't got time. I ain't got time. Oh, God. Anyway. Like I said, like, comment down below on what you guys do or what products that you love to moisturize your hair. Share it down below because we all need to know. Everyone should not be walking around with dry, brittle hair. You say, no, no. You can't be a part of the family if you're walking around with dry, brittle Are you mad? Are you mad? Is your mebrigi? Is your mebrigi? Are you alright? Is, is, is he alright? Is she alright? Anyway, my dear. This is it getting very long. <laughs> Bye. I'm going to see you in my next video. Bye.